it's your boy Tiff in his house. Bring another great edition of Modern Warfare 3 for me to you because hey, that's what I do. Ground War Domination 9v9 because that's what's up. And I want to get right into it. So, anyways, I was watching this video. Look at that shot. Isn't that beautiful? I love the way the AK looks with certain camo, but I'm going to get to that. So, I was watching this video. It was a video of, like, I think it was um, these pro players. And um, they were talking about 30 kills plus in a game, and, and that's pretty good. Like, I think the guy has 37 kills. And, uh, you know, I watch, the, I watch pro players most of the time, you know. Check out, see what guns that they're using. You know, see what their philosophy is, and they discuss those things. And, and then I try to translate those or transmute those things into, like, 9v9 game types. And competitive gameplay is not the same or would be the same as like a ground war game and I'm not taking nothing away from them I just the reason being is I watch their videos and then I try to use the weapons that they use and then it's like it's not as efficient as going against nine people and then on top of that you come to the realization that you know um yeah okay uh, you know uh, People are going to be using Quick Draw instead of Assassin Pro because it's only 4v4, 2v2. So there's just the variables are not the same in competitive gameplay versus pub matches. You know what I mean? Like, I think it's the only game that I know of that the rules change from pro, from pro gameplay to the original game types or gameplay. And, you know, for whatever reason, I don't know. But I was looking at, you know, I always look at to, to their to their gameplay, and I'm like, well, damn, if you can get 37 kills with that weapon in a pro match, that must be the shit. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna switch it up, and I'm using these weapons in the game, and I'm like, god damn, this. oh, okay, no wonder he's gonna use a quick uses some quick draw. No wonder he's pulling up his sights and fucking popping people this and that. And then I'm like, wait a second, you can't use quick draw in these games because everybody's running. Fucking assassin pro and shit. I'm gonna be, you know, everybody uses the most efficient, cheap shit in public matches. So, what pros use might not always work for you in a public match. That's what I was, that's the things that I came, that's my wisdom. That's the conclusion I came to on real time gameplay and then I'm regurgitating it back to you. So I'm like, that shit doesn't work. So like, you know, so I, there's different classifications of players in the community in what they do. And I, you know, I seriously, you know, I want to talk about some other stuff. So not, but I, I've decided that I wanted to leave, you know, my blog. I want to talk about things in the, you know, like specific game shit and game time rants game releases just anything that i have to say that has to do with ranting and i don't know if i'll do it on this channel because you know it's like i get mixed signals you know some days they'll say well you can't do this and you can't say this or you can't do this and and then the other days, it's like fucking just everybody just say what they what they, what they want to say, you know. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna go on my F2ST account, and I think I'm gonna like just keep real, you know, like real shit. Let's like really that I want to talk about, you know, like certain things that people don't understand in the community. That you know, okay, I'm going to say the things I'm going to say and they will make sense to you and then you'll go oh shit i get it now so uh i don't know if i'm gonna do that yet because as as you know it's just just the way the whole structure is around here that you can just like you know it, it because it comes out it comes out like you're being negative and i, I don't want to be negative i really don't but the shit that I say is real. You know, I experience every, every day, and I want to tell you guys about it, you know? And it's like, you know, but I don't want to come off like, oh, you're just hating on that guy. 
Oh no, I'm being real about it. I mean, if I was in the same situation, then fuck, I would be doing that. What that guy would be doing, or this, you know what I mean? They, to be honest with you, if you're a Call of Duty COD head or whatever, then specifically speaking, then you know these things would be relevant to you. Then they would make you understand, and you'd be like be more apt to go oh shit you know it makes a lot more sense now these are the reasons these things are happening blah 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 you know and that leads me into my next thing so anyways you know I know that I don't know if that made any sense to anybody but it will make sense later on when I start doing videos where I'm just like I'm gonna write them down I'm gonna talk about them because when I do videos on this channel I don't fucking sit here and write a script or none of that shit. I just say what I want been, that's been on my mind for a minute, and then I say it. Now, I might skip some points because I don't write them down. But for now on, when I play Modern Warfare 3 or any Call of Duty game, I'm going to write down the points. Look how I throw down the smoke, take the flag. That's how you do it. But I'm going to write down the points, and then I'm going to discuss this shit with you guys and tell you what, you know, that needs to be said in the game about the game not the other stuff that I was talking about on my other channel F2ST I'm gonna go through my rants like you know I'm gonna like specifically talk about you know this is why this shit happens this is why this fucking game is gonna be a flop blah 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 you know talking about other games not you know just in general you know the reasons why they're doing this is because of this stop lying to the people blah 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 you know what I mean I'm just basically I'm gonna be like a you know, uh, deep down in the trenches, I told you so, reporter, and it's, you know, like that in gaming, you know, in in game real time, you know, fucking giving you the facts because I'm there. Uh, I really wanted to talk about this game, but uh, <laughs> I tell you what, you know, took the old, you know, my dad, he was like, yo, let's go to the casino. So I, you know, he, you want to take care of your dad, you know, he gets to a certain point in his life and. You need to spend time with your family. You know, you're at your when you're in your teens, you're out banging ass and you're doing your things. Then you get older, you need a family, and then you realize that nobody's in their mortality is only so long. And you like to spend time with people, and you you know. So, anyways, we went out to the casino. Man, I had it was mad fun. I actually cracked out, and we were I played blackjack for like it, we played for like 12, 15 hours. It was great free room free everything i mean I, I tell you it was a relief i was gone all day and half a day or whatever it was and didn't get back until like just recently it was hella fun man made some money it was it was great time i like doing that and that also <laughs> brings me to my next point uh nasa and i are going to be holding poker tournaments and i'm going to do a video on that uh if you have a paypal account um and you want to get into these poker tournaments with us through the Xbox Live um, poker game, g grab that. That's going to be awesome. We're going to do 5, 10, 20 entry fees uh, for a certain each individual game. And I'll leave that in the, dis in the next video description and so on. So uh, I want to talk about this game. And um, the one little thing is I, I, I like, you know, I got all the gold guns, but now I'm using like color camo. Different the the camo to match the backgrounds, and I'm enjoying the uh, different types of schemes and setups that I'm using. I wanted to bring you the new the AK-47 gameplay as well. I've been having I've been having fun with this gun lately. Even though it's, you know what, this gun, you know, when you got the 1.5 multipliers on the ACR and the SCAR versus this gun, that's bullshit, man. You know, uh, the the AK man, this should have like a 1.7 or a 1.8 multiplier to your head. That thing's a beast, and it should be regarded as so, but it's not. You know, it's at a disadvantage. It's like a fucking, not even a full AC, AR rifle. You know what I'm saying? It's like, they give it shitty, the, like, one of the, like, right there. Come on, that thing was bouncing all over the fucking place. It didn't even hit the guy. And, uh, you know, that thing should tear you apart if it even touches you. But they don't do that. Anyways, I wanted to talk more about the gun and gameplay and all that stuff, and but I didn't have so much time to say all the stuff I wanted to say in this video. I hope you enjoyed this, and uh, and uh, until my next video, which will be tomorrow, I'll talk about the poker and all the other stuff, and do a bunch of videos and watch a bunch of football. And love you guys. Till next time, it's your boy Fist. Peace. And I'm out.